In all of my SAP based videos and articles, I showed you how to open the SAP logon window, choose the environment, go to the transaction, do whatever you need in this transaction. And after all of that, close the environment, but never showed you this uh, one thing. In this video, I'm going to show you how to close the SAP logon window. Let's remind ourselves every SAP connection code initialization, which I probably used in every article code. So starting from the first line, it opens SAP logon window from the given path using shell function, creates W script object to get activated SAP logon in the title bar, doing that in the loop, gets sub GUI into object, which is basically SAP logon window, and connects into given environment. In this video, I will focus on first two points. In given example, I declared and used WScript shell object to wait until the SAP application is activated. Wait still it is fully loaded. Let's use it earlier and put the SAP application into variable. So basically using WScript shell object, I launched the SAP application and set that into SAP object. You may ask, why use another object if you still using only WScript object to wait for SAP? I'm glad you asked. It is helpful in the end to close the SAP logon window after all transactions are done. I just read the ID of the SAP object created in the beginning of the code and told to close task kill the process. And just like that, the SAP logon window is closed. Another cool method to close SAP logon is to use functions from system library. In this case, it is user32 library. To make magic happen, you need two functions, find window and send message, and one constant. First of all, find the window ID by name using find window function then close the window using found uh, window id sub GUI window and constant wm close in the send message function a little bit longer but also effective like the first method unfortunately you can use that only if you know the version of sap i mean whole title top bar because you need to pass whole phrase to the function not part of it. Also, found the solution where there is used send keys method. It looks okay, but not really convinced to use that. Sometimes it can alt F4 close not the SAP logon window, but other things. Just showing that as a fun fact, not really as a solution. If you like this video, please leave a like down below and if you want to be updated about my latest uploads, please hit that subscribe button. I really, really appreciate that. Also, check out my website, simplexlvba.com and my Facebook profile. Thank you all for watching and see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.